Hi, Courtney. Hi, Merle. Nice to meet you. Welcome. All right, so I think you wrote in about painting your office? Yes. All right. Let me show you. Let's do All right, lots of wood paneling in this room. <laughs> yes. This is our home office, and we have done a little work. I can see you have the ceiling nice and clean, the walls. But we'd love your help with painting the paneling. The panels? All right, but you want to do everything? No, I would like to keep the crown molding and the cabinet. The cabinets. And also the sash. And the window sash. All right, sounds good to me. We can help with that, but one question, most important one. Do you have any color in mind for this woodwork? We were thinking about a blue. A blue? And we do have some samples. May I show you? Sure. Blue is my favorite color. Aha, here we go. Myro, these are the four samples that I am considering. OK. And it's important to me that we complement the paint on the walls and Agreed. the ceiling that yeah. we already painted. OK. One thing to consider, that office, when the sun hits the window, there's a lot of light breaking in in the morning, OK? Mm -hmm. So we're going to make sure that we choose a color that don't change so much with the light in there. OK. All right? So we have four different tones of blue in here. Mm -hmm. When you look at it, is that any color that you would say, Marl, I don't think this will work for me there? I'm not a fan of this not one. Not crazy about that mm -hmm. one? All right, let's put it that way. Now we came down to three colors here, right? A lot of gray in this one, like gray and blue, and this lighter gray from the other two, right? Now we have to take another one out which one do you don't consider to go into your office? This one seems a little too gray, given the size of the room. If you don't like that, we're going to take this one out. Yeah, right? take it out. Take it out. Now, we came down to two different undertones of blue. Portland, always go with your gut. OK. My gut says this is the one. If you guys said that, that's the one we go for it. Let's take this one out. Now that we know the color, I'm going to step out, get some paint, and you and I will go to work. Sounds good. We'll see you soon. OK. First thing what we're going to do, we're going to roll up the paper to protect the floor. I'll make sure you press it down all the way down. I don't want to cut this right here. Let's protect the edges of the window casing, mm -hmm. OK? Press it down. Just make sure you don't cover the panels, all right? Okay, ready to prime? Yes. All right, here's what we're gonna use. We're gonna do this uh, water-based bonding primer. Mm -hmm. Excellent for the surface that we're gonna be priming, which has this little gloss on the paneling walls, mm -hmm. and this will be perfect for us, okay? Okay. All right, let's open this can. A little here, here, oh. here. It's gray, it's not, why isn't that white? Gray primer will give us a good foundation for the paint that we're gonna use, which is this dark blue. It comes tinted by the manufacturer. Oh, okay. okay. Ready to go? Ready. Okay. I'll hit the grooves with the brush while you paint the panelings with the roller. This will ensure we don't end up with any bare spots in between the panels. Well, it's been an hour. Our prime is dry. It's time to paint. Are you ready for that? I'm ready. OK. On the ceiling, we used a flat paint. Got it. What yes. finish are we using here? Uh, for the wooden panel, we're going to do a matte finish. Why matte? Matte finish reflects less light than any other finish. Mm, I already like that color. Wait until you see up on the wall. It's going to be even better. Man, I love this blue. Mm. 
Wow, Courtney, what about this room? It's incredible. Amazing. I love your color selection, and we went with the matte finish for the walls. Perfect. The room's like beautiful. Is there anything we need to know? Yes, what I would suggest for you to do, don't bring anything into this room or hang anything into the walls. Wait at least until tomorrow because paint is dry, but it's not completely cured. So tomorrow on, it's all yours. All right? If you have any more projects, painting projects, let me know. We'll come by. We'll help you out. Thank okay? you so much. Thank you. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button to make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.